Hello, Namaste, Salam Alaikum, Sastriyakal. Welcome back to another session with your washer at Vareva.com. Today we are going to make very simple mushroom soup. You know this is going to be like a cream of mushroom soup in which I am going to slightly Indianize for you all. So dear friends, let's go ahead and make this cream of mushroom soup. In a pan add butter, in this add some chopped garlic and chopped onion. Add salt. Now I am going to add button mushrooms in this and nicely saute them. You know you want this uh, onions and these mushrooms to be slightly brown. You know the caramelization of these mushrooms give a very nice awesome flavor. And I also add a pinch of sugar, lot of chefs do not do this. I add pinch of sugar because that helps to give a not only caramelization color but helps the mushroom to give a good flavor out pinch of um, sugar and uh, mix this. We have to cook on a slow flame till these mushrooms get slightly golden in color. So reduce the flame. After you add the sugar and salt in it, the mushrooms are going to ooze out all the moisture out. Now this is the moisture from the mushrooms, onion and garlic also and we are going to evaporate this water and we are going to cook it further till the mushrooms get slightly golden in color. For any good soup, a good stock is always a foundation. For this soup, do not make a stock which has got lot of flavors because mushroom itself has a very nice dominating flavor and which is very good. So make a mild stock of chicken or vegetable. If you are vegetarian, use vegetable stock. If you are a meat eater, use chicken stock. Even I sometimes use the prawn stock which I am going to show another time which is awesome too. The mushrooms are really really good, they are extremely good in lot of vitamins, calcium, phosphorus and so many. In fact I made one of the dish using mushrooms which surprisingly will taste like a nice meat preparation. Go and check mushroom fry one of my old videos and try and make that, that's even more awesome. Now you can see these mushrooms nicely kind of caramelized and slightly golden in color. Now this is good enough. I am going to add some thyme. This is an herb that you can add to give a very nice flavor. It goes well with mushroom. So I have dried thyme here. So I am going to add some and also I am going to add some flour for thickening. Just uh, around half a teaspoon should be good enough. This is awesome aroma now. Yeah, yeah, yeah. The reason why I added this flour is See once you prepare the soup after blending this, still it will look like curdled. So it makes sure that the soup is nicely emulsified and it will be a nice cream soup. In this add some chopped leeks. This is also optional. Since I have, I am adding it. Add chicken stock, hot chicken stock. Bring it to a boil and cook it for like 10 more minutes till this is nicely cooked. After blending this soup, you are going to have a very nice cream of this mushroom soup. Just uh, pot it back to the boil and now I am going to add cream. You are going to condition it and then mix it with the rest of the soup. Okay, now look at it. You know, perfect cream soup. Wow! This is a nice thick soup. But if you want to make it a little bit uh, thinner, you can always add a little bit of stock and mix with it. Ah. Dear friends, you will not believe the mushroom can be so tasty. You know, add a little bit of thyme and your soup will be super awesome. Lot of chefs, I have seen they serve the same soup as mushroom cappuccino. What they do is, they kind of uh, take the froth of the milk by whisking the milk and pour it on top of this and serve in a coffee mug and call it mushroom cappuccino. If you want to try that, you can do that also. But Wow, you know, dear friends, when I started the soup, I added pinch of sugar. I'm telling you, that makes a lot of difference. And thyme with mushroom is an excellent combination. Look at these slices with nice parsley, garlic butter, with nice pieces of mushroom on it. Look how beautiful it looks. So simple. Whenever you serve this kind of soup, make something innovative and special like this so that your guest will say 
you are an awesome chef dear friends i hope you enjoyed today's session but do not forget varava is all about inspiring others to cook so please post your recipes and cooking tips at varava.com so others can benefit from your great cooking thank you mm. these mushrooms are a fungi and they don't need sunlight to grow and also when we were kids we used to call these mushrooms raat ki rakshas because you sleep and you wake up and you see these mushrooms early in the morning and you will wonder where they have grown from so we used to call the devils from the night Thank you.